Good morning, Fellowship High Crest. My name is Trisha, and this is Jumpstart. I will be reading today from 1 Thessalonians chapter 2, verses 10 through 12. And it says, You yourselves are our witnesses, and so is God, that we were devout and honest and faultless towards all believers. And you know that we treated each of you as a father treats his own children. We pleaded with you, encouraged you, and urged you to live your lives in a way that God would consider worthy, for he called you to share in his kingdom and glory. So when I read that, there was a couple words that really jumped out at me. First of all, living your life in a way that God would consider worthy of his kingdom and glory, but also the words um, devout and honest and faultless. So as I reflected on those, I thought back to some different days that I maybe left my job and, you know, would go through and I had done all of the things on my checklist, accomplished all of the tasks, but didn't still necessarily feel great about my day's work. And I think that that's kind of what Paul is reflecting here. He's talking more about the heart and the character and living that life filled with integrity. And it's not about the tasks that we accomplish, but that we're living fully in a way that honors God and that we can stand before him one day and, and know that um, everything we did was, let's see, those words, devout and honest and faultless. Wow, that's a high standard, of course, but it's a high God that we serve. And obviously that is a very integrity uh, integrity filled way to live our lives so that's the challenge to live in a way that we can stand before God faultless and devout and considered worthy of sharing in his kingdom and his glory keep powering up pouring in and spilling out have a great day